Hello, I'm Paul Karpovich here at Two Technical again. Uh, doing a video for the Warrior Collective. So, you know, I'm just going to do a little instructional video. Don't even. Well, to be honest, we'll, I'll work on some methods with you with uh, different methods on how to kick different different varieties and stuff. You know, because I believe in all different methods work. Some people like to. You know, stick with one way and one way only, whereas I'm pretty open-minded. I believe that you need to be pretty open-minded and, you know, um, have different ways of doing the technique for different different scenarios. So I'll go through a few of that. Hopefully it'll help you guys uh, be a bit more creative and stuff, so we'll see. So, let's start off with left kick, yeah, on its own. So we've got left body kick, yeah? A few different methods of how to do it. One of the most methods is a skip. Yeah, you understand about the skip, so that's like where you, your left foot sort of switches, so you lift this up, the best way I can explain it, lift it up a touch off the floor, yeah, and you got to listen to what I'm saying. Before this leg hits the floor, this leg moves to the side, yeah, some people say, yeah, you switch like this, which, yeah, you can do, but what you want to do is, see, as that's dropping, this one's moving, you get me? So, I just like to turn it a little bit like that, so, you like, up, and then you throw the kick. Now see, see when you do that, obviously in the guards are not open, nothing like that, but you want to have your hands high, use your where you can see them, so you can protect your face, you can swing as well if you want for power, but, so see from there, this one comes up a little bit, and as you switch, boom, your left kick, now see from here when you do the left kick, you want to land here, in your guard, yeah, bang, ready to throw, a lot of people, even myself sometimes, natural, people go like, boom, 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 you bring your feet together for a split second, which I believe is not, not ideal if someone's good, he's counting you with. I found when I've done it in the past, especially if I, in like K1 or practicing the K1 method, as you kick here, boom, and as you land in here, rather than stepping in, you get, you get caught back. So I've always found the best method how to do is skip, kick, land in. Yeah, so you land in nice and close, or you skip and kick, boom, land at the back. That's why I think it's important that you understand on how to switch in, switch in your guard. So also with the skip kick, you can travel with the distance. You know what I'm saying? So I've got close, close range like that. See that? You see that the left comes up, like it. I can use it off a block, he kicks me, and that block, and then into the skip, up. You move back a little bit, skip from here. You know what I mean? So you skip, up, and throw the kick. You know what I mean? And then, and then come from there. Always get back to your guard or land nice and square in the front. You go skip to the body. Also, you can like a black, it's very rare you do this one. But like skip, whack, volley on the inside. That's perfect if, you know, sometimes you throw a big skip and he's leaning back like this, yeah? Whoop. And then you've got to balance, be ready afterwards. And then what you do second time, you skip, whack, and then, then land and go with the skip kick again. That's a nice technique. Um, so, see when you kick as well, this is where, this is what I wanted to go through with the originals, what kind of went off track, but yeah, so you, when you skip and kick, you've got a couple of methods, you've got coming round with the kick, coming up with the kick on an angle, some people, honestly, the kick like this looks not good technique, but whack, and it's just like bang, like boom, and it'll just lean, but see when they do that, bang, it hurts, it's quite painful, do you know what I mean, someone kicks you like that, that's it to keeping this leg straight, so you got options, that's what I'm saying, you got your leg bent, your leg straight, different uh, techniques for different stuff. So say for example I have my leg bent, it's usually, if he's blocking the kick, he's always blocking, I can loop it over the block and come round and in, do you know what I mean? It's more, it's quicker, but when you do that, that straight leg one like that, poof, they hurt, you know what I mean? It's like a back coming up and you can, you don't have to, I, I still turn the foot slightly when I do it. And I don't come directly up, I can keep him boom, straight in the groin. On a little bit of an angle, yeah, there. Like, bap, like that. You sort of lean, boom. You see Sanchez, he's like, oh, man, boom, but he's obviously from Southport. Bam, straight from the back, like that. Yeah, you do the same there, boom. But then also, you got them, them ones where you come in round, bang, dropping them in. Do you know what I mean? Or you got a bit of both, you know what I mean? Both, like straight up, but slightly on an angle. So try different methods, you get a bag or you get a person. Sometimes you can get him to put his arm like that. I'll do it from the south ball for you now without the skip. So yeah, but remember you've got the skip with the distance, so you got like that. So you're coming straight up a little bit. Try on different methods and then try and turn your foot a little bit. Up, up, and then come round a bit. Boom, start coming in. Boom, try and come round with your legs straight. Boom. So you try different methods, see which one suits you. Talk to your partner, ask him which one hurts the pad more, which one feels harder. 
and then you'll see which um, which kick suits you. Perfect for low kicks, you are. Boom, you kick someone's leg. Oof. How's that feel, Diddy? Not very okay? nice. Yeah, that's not nice. What about this one? Yeah, so it's that one. Sometimes, like that one, depends on how you dig it in. Because you like flick it like that. Boom, that can be painful as well. So you like bang and drop it in. Sometimes you do like, you just volley it in. Do you know what I mean? So you got. You got fair different <laughs> sorry bro. You got fair different methods on the on the kicks, yeah? So you got a few different different varieties. But what I'm saying is you can kick round, kick up. Now also let me just go through this with your wrapping while I'm here. You got stepping in. Yeah? So you step in and throw the kick. Boom! Now usually you do this when you punch in. Problem about stepping, I think I've been through this one before, but I don't know, is when you step, he can see. You understand what I'm saying? So when I step in, if he's real good, he's gonna time a teep. If his feet are planted and he's ready, as I step, he's there. Do you know what I mean? Or as I step, he's, he's connecting me with shots. Yeah? So, but you use a step, you can use it clever. See, like that. Lift your knee up so he can't teep you, and then come in with it. Bang! Do you know what I mean? And then throw it like that. Or, or the other method, you see from there, sneak into range. So you just sort of sneak into the range like that, and then just bang! And then just lift your leg up. That one's a lot harder to see. And then also you've got like, say for example, I'm moving back, and see that I use my back foot, and I come like that, like I'm going back, but then you just push forward, and come up with your kick. So hopefully you understand that, so see you've got step, I'll break it down short, left step, yeah? Just lift straight up, or use the back foot, boom, to spring off, and then angle your kick on different angles, see which one's best for you. Your hands want to be mainly right hand up, Left hand can swing for your balance. It's a nice simple one for you. Uh, I'll do some more on off for that stuff in a bit. But yeah, man, my name's Paul Karpovich. You want to uh, come check me out? Check me out on Facebook, Too Technical Muay Thai, or go on to me Instagram, Paul Karpovich. Uh, thanks, and check out some more videos on Warrior Collective.